is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Hi, everyone. Monday, the 24th of October. This is the 10 a.m. Tiger Financial News Network market update. We're looking at the Dow 319 at 31,400. This is a fantastic move off the low that was made just uh, over a week ago at uh, 28,660. Here we are, 31,373. Bumping into the Chapman Wave inside track, the new inside track. No, sorry, this is the wedge, inside wedge, target resistance line. And that I'd been looking for 31,250 to, to, uh, to the, towards the 31,300 level as a test of strength. Today, we've gone up to 31,570. So there could be a bit of a rest. That Mirboza candle of Friday, basically no wicks, big, big candle, uh, green candle, says that there are three outcomes. One is a doji candle today, a small little doji candle with a decline tomorrow. The other's an immediate pullback. But the third one is the most bullish. And that says you gap to the upside and have a very strong candle. Well, the day's young. We're not even 35 minutes into the trading day. So we'll see what happens by the end of the day. But this is really good action. Weekly chart still needs a lot of work. Let's go to the S&P. The S&P is... Uh, 37.76 is up 24. It went to the 37.96 area. Remember, I had said 38.08 to 38.12 area is really what you want to see to be able to get to that left side high uh, in the 39.07 level back in September. That's a real big ask. We're looking for QQQ. Uh, that's pulling back a little bit, down 93 cents at 274. The the queues are struggling a little bit, and one of the reasons is that it also has the semiconductors, and they are already the benchmark for that the Nasdaq, and they're pulling back a little bit. You're looking at the IWM, the Russell 2000, uh, down 21 cents as well, 172. So it's really the Dow that's leading everything. You're looking at gold. Hmm, this is going to be interesting. Gold is uh, down three at. Uh, 1653. Did have an earlier spike, but it's pulled back from the 1675. It's that dollar. The dollar is still fairly strong. It's up uh, 30 ticks at 112.31. Crude oil uh, is pulling back a little bit. Oh, it's come back now. It's unchanged. And the TLT, TLT didn't make it. No, oh, it's holding above the yesterday's or Friday's high. We'll talk about that when I get back with the Tiger Technicians out. See you in a moment. Check out my opening call news.